I'm in South Florida catching and cooking invasive species, and tonight on the menu is snakeheads. Get him, get him. Oh, oh my gosh, Nick. <laughs> That's a big ass We're snake. We're making tacos, <laughs> baby. Something to note about these guys is they have been known to cross lakes on land. Like, they can actually move on land. I don't know if they can breathe. Oh, I'm so sorry. You guys had to witness that. Into the cooler you go with your brother. It is illegal to transport these things if they're alive. To fillet a snakehead is a lot like filleting any other fish. And what you're going to do is find that first fin on the side of its body and cut all the way down to its spine. You're going to follow that up by bringing the knife all the way down the length of its body. And by the end of it, you should have a nice fillet. So check this out. This is actually a row sack of the thing. But this guy was pregnant. I think I might have gotten a third of what I actually could have. I really need to practice filleting these snakeheads. Always leave things cleaner than when you found it. That is a rule that goes for life, not just fish. What do we have here, Grandma? Wow, that looks really good. This is the finished result. You guys should totally go out there and try to catch one of these. They are delicious.